be making that sound, or should I be so scared? You have nothing to worry about. Right now, I own a Lamborghini Huracan, and uh, it just wasn't doing it for me, so uh, I thought, let's figure out how to make this better. So we kind of started developing the car and put giant turbos on it. You're like, oh, this is a thousand horsepower. This is awesome. But there's a lot of drifting here, and that's definitely a new one for me. You know, everyone's still saying, oh my god, how are we going to get an automatic Lambo to drift? No one's ever seen it, but it's racing. Anything can happen. He admits that he does not have a car built for this type of competition, but he wants to prove to everybody out there that he is a driver that knows how to adapt. Drifting nearly impossible, but Jordan has made his living solving problems, and he and his team think that they can pull off the impossible. Rudd, what's he got to do to adapt to this track? Well, this is an all-wheel drive car, but Jordan and his team have MacGyvered a switch that can cut the power to the front wheels, making it rear-wheel drive. Their plan is to use all-wheel drive for speed and two-wheel for the precision obstacles. First up is a rock return at Supernova, so we're about to find out if they're as smart as they think they are. That is insane. Nice. <laughs> that was good.